So he said, if you can't swim, sink. Well, that sounds like him. Next! Oh, hey. Wow. Go this like, is really uh, nice. And then that's him, right yes. there. Okay. Hello. Oh, hello. Name and profiles, please. Oh, my name is uh, Rob Schwartzman. Yes, Robert. I, by the way, I saw your tape, and you ooze talent. How fast can you run? What do you, what, like, like, well, I, if you had to run for a bus, for instance. Oh, uh, pretty fast, I guess. Okay, this show is groundbreakingly unusual. Just like anything else, there's risks. Oh, okay. You would be living in a pit the duration of the show. Uh-huh with flames all around you, oh. while the other cast members are throwing things at you at the same time, you have to identify what it is. Wow, that sounds really interesting. Now, we have to tell you direct and honestly that the last host um, did not follow instructions and was careless and perished. Well, okay, you know, I mean, mistakes can happen sometimes. From what I understand, there's about a 98% chance death index on this show. So that means there's about a 98% chance that someone could perish. Well, you see, that, that, that's, that's a chance. I mean, I, I like to take chances. Okay, Robert, this is, this is what we're trying to do. We're trying to create a living hell, okay? You'll be in the pit uh, with flames, and there'll be maniacs down there that you'll have to control. Right, right, okay. Wait, did you say maniacs? Yes. You mean I have to tell them what to do and, 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 and stuff like that? Exactly, control them so they don't mess with you. And they will. I mean, that's what they're gonna try to do. I see, okay. No, that sounds interesting. Have you worked with maniacs before? No. No, 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 never. Um, I'm sure I could, though. Have you ever worked with flames before? Well, um, not necessarily. Also large bats. Um, wait, wait, what? From the photos I've seen, these are very large bats. You know, they would be swooping down on you. Would you find this distracting from your goals for the show? No, I don't think so. You know, if I had to host a show, I'd try to do it, regardless of bats or anybody else. Uh, so, the pay is $47 per day initially. Wow. Um, yeah, that, that also sounds okay. Also included is one meal for the 12 hour day and also some credit and coffee. No, that, that, that sounds okay. I, have you ever consumed a bat? No. No, um, I haven't. Um, okay, do you look forward to the idea of eating a bat? You mean like eating one? Yes. <laughs> I guess so. In other words, you would have to knock one down to the ground and prepare it in flames. You mean I have to cook it myself? That's correct. No, no, I, no. Why? I mean, well, I mean, if you could cook it for me, I wouldn't mind eating it, but, but what? A bat, I mean, as long as I don't see it cooking, I, I know I could devour it. Have you had any experience with snakes? Uh, no. You see, because the bats are foes of snakes, that's why they're on the show. The snakes are wrapped around your ankle, the bats attack them all the while you're trying to control the maniacs. No, no, I, I'm, I'm, I'm not afraid of snakes. Are you at all, and, and be honest here, afraid of the maniacs? No, not really. Um, what would you do to them? I mean, if they started attacking, I, I'd fight them off. This is what people are tuning in for. Well, I mean, that's what they tune in for, right? I mean, you, you, you gotta give them their money's worth. Excellent. Okay, just so that we understand on this side, can you repeat what we've discussed? Sure, sure. Okay, 
it seems like you want me in some kind of a pit trying to, to develop a living hell. And uh, I have lots of flames. Um, I have to work with maniacs and I have to watch out for the bats flying around. I get one meal a day and I'll be in there in the pit for 12 hours a day and I got to eat a bat. Is there anything else you'd like to add? No, yeah, no, I, uh, I, I, I like to try.